Yeah, it's looking to be another late night, honestly. I don't know when I'll get my next Kate. Game stream time or poggers for you. I don't know whether it's really poggers for me, but, you know, it is what it is. Yeah, I've been staying up pretty late as of na as of late, so... If I want to make excuses, it's quote unquote acclimatization to European time zone. Well, thank you for a one leaf discount. I think I have exactly 61,750 leaves for Viper Dagger. Couldn't have done it without you. Yes, I am, Sunny. I should really study a bit of German. Should I should do some reading. Read some news articles. What not to get myself warmed up again before I travel? Pretty close, actually. <laughs> oh, yeah, probably could. It's gonna be two months of, I guess, pretty hardcore studying for me because there's some deadlines I. I kind of want to meet. Thank you, Tressa. You've been a big help this run. One leaf discount. Surprise the sleeping pirate. You're really safe having you here. Oh, fuck. Damn it, Tressa. Okay, you know what? I'll I'll take this. Okay, I'll take I'll take this. It's not ideal, but I'll take it. Five encounter chapter one. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm going for. Garbage Tressa one. Another garbage Mega Mac, honestly. I'm getting this exact pattern every single run. It's crazy. How? Like, it just happens like every single run. This exact pattern. Please attack. Okay, no, looks like I have to do the slow strat. Two. <laughs> 16 seconds behind. It's not that far beyond my PB actually.
<laughs> okay. It is actually the trash chapter one that summoned the cat. <laughs> we, in fact, did it. We actually did it. Yeah, let's see how many escapes Tressa fails. That's one. Let's fail one. I'm just gonna yield all of these because I have grapes anyway. That's two. Not off to a good start, Tressa. If we really ball her, we can... We can get into Atlas then. I do, I do. I do have grapes. So I can heal up before that. That's free! It's supposed to be level 14. Oh my god. Tressa, please. The fun just never stops. Okay, that, that's the first YOLO she's she's gotten. Even when she's level 14. Oh joy, just feel it. She's gonna fail. Okay, she actually got the YOLO. Okay, that's my last grade, I think, so... Hopefully don't take too much damage. Really close. Always right at the entrance. Oh no! Broke it out of sleep. Okay, attack please. Okay, great. Standard. Standard sheep, I guess. Sheep, help me. Waking me up. When's Octopuff anniversary? I I I don't actually know. Cause we usually do an ass race for Octopuff anniversary, don't we? Which I didn't join the previous few times. I could probably join this time if I'm free. Though it might occur around the marathon season, so he's originally in July. Okay, that's kind of like marathon season, though. I feel. So like, it depends on everyone's availability, I guess. <laughs> You're dumb. Switch is July. Yeah, I know there's one in July. PC's- okay, PC's June. I see, okay. Well, well that's pr I mean, they're pretty close to each other, to be honest, and we all may or may not be free, but, well, 
I guess we can always settle on it. Date that everybody could make it. Friday, at least. Stay in the end. April 28th. Let's go. It's actually pretty soon. It's like in less than a week. Well, less than a week for me. Well, I guess it should be the 22nd in the US already. So yeah, less than a week. I do not have Stadia. Wait, Stadia is not a console, right? It's like a... Is it a console? I don't actually know. It shows how important it is. The streaming service. Okay. It's kind of weird, but... Okay. I could go for Yolo Merchant. Nice. I could go for Yolo Merchant because I, I would die. But I think it's like usually a, it's usually a time loss, so... Whatever, I'll just... Just do this. I would have died to, uh... I would have died in one hit, most likely. Oh yeah. June, July is pretty busy. I mean, with all the... Marathons and stuff, I guess. Not sure if you have a lot of work as well. I think you did mention something about work. Summer school. I see. Yeah, work. <laughs> Eleven last year. Is that normal? Uh, I mean, is that a lot? How many are you gonna have this year? Do you know? Your normal load it you had less than a tenth of what you're supposed to have? What? I mean that's it's really little. Is it cause of COVID or something? Oh, okay. Oh, you mean like normally in like outside of summer school you have like 160 students or something? But nobody wants to go to summer school, so... Yeah, I've been getting really dumb luck lately. I could get the Thunder M, but it's kind of slow, so... I've been getting pretty bad luck in the exploration. I had like two tunnels. I had like two tunnels and counters just now in, in one of the, the first run of the day. 
154 pities. It's like a hundred and one Dalmatians, except 154, and it's not Dalmatians, it's cats. Which is a lot of cats. Yeah, I just fear that if, let's say, like, by some miraculous stroke of luck, I actually make it into GDQ, and then, like, I'm, like, really busy with school or something, then that's gonna suck. Adrian. Thank you for a good luck. I need good luck. I've had three bad luck already. Die once. Oh, there will be poggers, yeah. Although I'm hoping GDQ if if like if they accept me. They would take Xenoblade. Well, there it's good too, but I feel like Xenoblade would be more hype. I'm doing good, thank you for asking. <laughs> this is only like the second day of actual Sears grinding. But yeah, I do want to just quickly, I, just, I do want to just PV and uh, take a break from this category. Yeah, but you gotta ride in that hype and get it into GDQ. <laughs> oh man, I really hope. I really hope I get it in. It would be so good if we could get it in. Yeah, GDQ is in person this year. This summer. Although it's pretty restricted, but it's still in person. I really would like to go to the US one day. I think it should be possible. I, I think I should be able to sometime in the future. Maybe if there's like a RPG limit break. I will go for that one. I will try to go for that one, because Sanjan's gonna go for that one as well. RPG limit break if it happens in person. I'm sure I'll see like some of y'all there as well.
Salt Lake City is good beer. Oh my god, what's gonna introduce me to some of that? Now, I'm, I'm normally not a beer drinker, but I, I can appreciate some good craft beer. Craft cider? Yo, let's go. Sounds like my thing. Yeah, I'm just not- I'm just not a big- I'm just not a drinker in general. I, I don't really drink. I'm not averse to drinking, I just don't usually drink. But I can appreciate some good quality beverages. Belgian beer. Did you have seen some of the beer that beer that Sunny and I uh, saw in uh, Sweden? <laughs> They're like really interesting flavors. What, what, what was the what was the what was the weirdest flavor that we saw in Sweden? Sunny. <laughs> Strawberry cheesecake beer. Yeah, that one was. <laughs> then there's like this one, but licorice vanilla cake thing also. That was really funny. It's really interesting. I we didn't get that one though. That one was like thirteen percent alcohol by volume or something. It was really strong. Get one in July, yo. This time, if I go to ESA, I'll, I'll, I will do my best to go to ESA. So if I do go to ESA, I, I will set up the, the bridge. <laughs> the DIY bridge. So, um, that was my mistake, I didn't do it last time. Or I did it, but not in... I couldn't do it in time. It's ESA. It's like... I think July. Yeah, it's late July. Oh, bike tour of Copenhagen. Interesting. As expected of our beer buff Sunny. Beer buff Sunny. It's a really good it's a really good idea, actually. Like it's a really good tourist idea. Like visiting like breweries and stuff. Because it's not I I wouldn't say it's it, it's not very conventional. But at the same time, it's like really interesting, and uh, and uh, yeah, just it's just pretty cool to visit breweries and stuff. There's always a uh, ESA winter next year, or even the summer next year.
Yeah, I, I think the ESA hotel was... I, I, I don't know, because I don't really have anywhere to compare with, but I think, like, for what we got, it was pretty affordable, especially because we were, like... And it's, it's more affordable, of course, if you share it with other people, but even for, like, us who, like, stayed alone, I, I, I don't think the price is, like, really high or unreasonable or anything. And the quality of the hotel was really good for what we paid. I actually found it pretty strange that it didn't have, like, rooms with, like, only one bed. All the rooms were like, <laughs> even if you're st if you're staying alone, like they'll give you rooms with like two beds. Just found it pre pretty strange that they didn't have like single bedrooms. My room was pretty big, to be honest. I think my room was uh bigger than the, the first room i stayed in was pretty big then when i had to extend for one day I, I moved into a smaller room so i think like they just gave me like a bigger room or something just gave me they gave me like a bigger room But the second time when I extended for one day, I got a smaller room. A smaller room, but it was still like two beds. So the second room I stayed in was like closer to what Bowie was. Uh, Bowie's room, which was smaller. <laughs> so, oh, this guy, he's traveled from so far. We have to give him a really big, nice and spacious room. Actually, the room was pretty damn cold, because I think it was, like, because the room was so spacious, it was, like, it felt pretty cold. I turned, I turned the air conditioning, like, all the way up, like, to, to like, the maximum temperature. <laughs> and it was still really cold for me. Sweden, Sweden was really cold, and more so the wind than anything else, but really cold. But yeah, every time I think back to, to ESA, I just have like really fond memories, even though it just happened. So yeah, that's why I want to go to ESA again. I, I believe you when you said that, like, GDQ is a lot different because there's a much bigger crowd. The crowd there is different. Comfort zone? What, what What do you mean comfort zone? It's like, is it because it's in the US or you're more familiar with the place? But yeah, I do think the vibe of the crowd at ESA was really, really nice. Ah, okay, yeah. I mean, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> I guess for me, it wouldn't make a difference. Except for the fact that I can read English.
Because it, it will be in a different country for me anyway. But yeah, that would be lost at Ivor. Dude, you don't have to guess what's in your Poke Bowl. <laughs> But they were really, the people in Sweden are really nice. They all spoke English, like, very happily <laughs> to me. I tell you what, I really like the 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 kebab. <laughs> I hope the place is still open when when yeah no it'll definitely be open. I don't see the place closing down. I really like that kebab. <laughs> I just have a thing for rats, I think. I ate quite a few rats when I was in Germany as well. There's an F of meetup in Philly? Wow. Was Mutski there? <laughs> Yo, base kebabs. Never go wrong with kebabs, honestly. Never go wrong with kebabs. I haven't been to Spain before. It would be cool to visit Spain as well. Oh, okay, Matsuki was in there. I have no idea which part of the US Matsuki lives in, to be honest. I, I think he probably told me before or something like that, or told me his time zone, I just can't remember. Oh, he lives in Texas? Texas, cool. I don't know much about Texas.
All right, thank you, Sunny. Hope you get your work done quickly as well. Uh, I mean, hope you're, yeah, hope, hope everything goes well too. What a burger. I have no idea what it is. <laughs> it, what a burger. Is it good? Not really. <laughs> Is it better than McDonald's? The identical to McDonald's? Okay, then... Then I guess that says something. That speaks... That answers my question. <laughs> it's kind of like Max Burger in Sweden. So, there's this, uh... There's this burger chain called Max Burger in Sweden and it's kind of like McDonald's except it's better <laughs> oh yeah well, Matsuki just loves to loves to speak in like different languages I think It's kind of strange, I thought it would kill. <laughs> Oops. I thought I split. Yeah, I think I just got like low rolls. I thought the stock bonk would help, though. Apparently, did. I did put on the elemental road. I think I would have noticed if Therion had the elemental road. Shadow Owl, Shadow M should be at the bottom. It's pretty nice actually, but I mean, it's not ideal, but it could be worse. Give the nuts to the correct people. Narsh S goes to Tressa. First nut will go to Tressa.
Yeah, I didn't need to give them an AVP, but it's whatever. Realm Copier, thank you for the raid. Thank you for the good luck. I do not have Essence of Pomegranate, that was last turn. Everything's kind of in reverse. The news, everything are in reverse. So I, I think later on I want to swap them into the correct spots. That's when I'm uh, recruiting Hanit. I'll put Elfin in the second slot and then I'll put Hanit over Cyrus when I'm there. That way Tressa will Go back to the fourth slot. Okay, I did not have to burn. I still have my light M, don't I? I didn't have to burn. I didn't have to burn my extra, uh, any of my extra M stones, so I should have three extra M stones now. Did I have? Bad ambush or something? My PB, I think I might have gotten a pretty bad ambush. Or maybe my menu was not up to standard. Probably wasn't. But I think I also got a pretty bad ambush. I think Alfin got hit like three times or something in the run two days ago. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. For some reason, Alfin... Everybody hates Alfin. They always target him. Okay, very nice. This one is... Is this one the best encounter? Maybe, maybe not, but it is a good encounter. So, if we can save an Elstern here, that would be really nice. That is really far. Oh my. That's the worst encounter. I can't save the Elstone though. Does... Does Elfin... Get enough SP at this rate? JP at this rate? I have no idea. Learn? Why are you learning? Oh, you're learning a Chronum Trigger, aren't you? I saw. I saw it on your Twitter. <laughs> I'm glad- I'm glad to be of help. Uh, two. Nice. How's it go how's it coming along? So many could have been faster, but 
all in all a pretty good chapter two i have no idea if alfin gets his skills though maybe not because i got the trees which are the worst encounter Oh, I asked, uh, how's your, how's learning Chrono Trigger coming along? How's it going, I mean, yeah. It's always really, it's always really fun to learn a new game or category, I think. More so game. Yeah, it's always fun to learn a new game, it's just... Like, suddenly a lot of things you don't know and you, feel, you get to see yourself improving as you do runs. <laughs> it's that, it's... It's fun. <laughs> Wouldn't know, <laughs> Lexa. Oh, Pog, he has just enough. Alpin is just enough. Theron's... Theron's like... Theron's like no HP. I guess it's because of the tree encounter that he's like really low level right now. Oh yeah, yeah. I do wanna. I do wanna pick up a new game. Just eventually, just need to find the time. Once I'm done with this, I'll probably try to learn a new game. It's pretty bad. Okay, lower critical or uh, fine. Pretty much how the lizards always go nowadays. Actually, pretty lucky they use lower critical light twice. It could have been really ugly otherwise. But yeah, I do want to learn a new game. It's wrong. No discounts. Okay, my extra M stones are thunder and fire, so I have two M stones currently that I can burn. Uh, 
Very nice. Merchant first, please. No, this is really bad. Hopefully, don't kill people. That's the best one to hit. Okay, stop in the area. Okay, okay, that's fine. Alpin is down. Alright, please hit the range. Very nice. I think OP was at level 15, so that might have been a range. Oh no, she was at level 16, okay. Because of the nice encounter that we got. It sucks that we got ambushed by it though, but... That, that encounter gave, gives like the most XP JP out of like all the encounters on that screen. So it sort of makes up for the fact that we got the 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 bat OP2 encounter. Yeah, could have gone faster, definitely. That I think that ambush cost me like 15 seconds or something. And then the lizard's fight, obviously, went pretty poorly as well. Yeah, you have to remember that Alpin is in the bottom slot. Therion is in, still in the same slot, thankfully.
Seems like we haven't gotten many discounts this run, eh? Uh, apart from uh, the one we got. I think on the Mighty Bow we got one, but that's about it. Okay, I'll put this in the bottom slot. Alright, no early encounter. We've gotten like early encounters like for the past couple of runs or something, and it's really, really scary when you see that. Good, that's, that's alright, I guess. I can't one turn this. I think I will one turn this. For extra. Extra JP. I get like 14 extra JP. Uh, nice FTK. First turn kill. For that bonus 10% JP. Every little bit of JP adds up. Could make a difference later. Money wise, seem to be doing okay actually. I think 150, 152 is like pretty normal to see. You you definitely should be above 150. I think uh, in this chapter, with the current money route, you should you should always be above. You should be above 150 unless I, I don't know you bought like some extra stuff. Okay, this is the big boy screen. Right, come on, big boy. Oh, so close. I'm down my fire. They get a bloom. Okay. I will get this. It's not ideal, but it's what it is. Yeah, I will do this. So give myself a bit of extra bolt. Yeah, I'm gonna lose a the time here, I think. Hopefully I can save time on the next split, actually. 
I almost feel like it's not worth it to grab the 30k if you get the encounter there. Because it's pretty slow to get. Not Tressa, okay, very good. So, we do lose some time. We lost 27 seconds. The good thing about getting that encounter, though, is that it. I mean, that encounter was the fastest encounter we could have gotten, so we didn't lose that much time. We do have extra money, which sadly we can't use to do any big skips. But it uh, does at least make the money route later a lot better. Potentially, can skip the Gone Collect if it comes down to that. Uh, what else? Uh, I will be able to skip the Orwell encounter. So I'll play my free encounter skip. Well, as long as I don't get the encounter before the save point. And hopefully I'm not triple unlucky and I get the, the Sparrow encounter again for the third time in a row. According to zero, it's like twenty percent to get it or something. So I, I, you shouldn't be getting it that often. But I have. I had to burn my fire actually. Yeah, you so. I could. I, I think I should have screwed the thunder L here. It's kind of. I think that was kind of a mistake. I should have screwed the Thunder L. Because now my fire my fire's gone. My light is gone. Yeah. I think Elstone Supplies, I am at neutral right now. So I will have enough for Dry Sign, which is the two I still have two thunders. I might have a wind as well, so I have two thunders and a wind. I want to save the wind, so I have to use the thunders. Uh, though I really feel like I should just save the wind, regardless. Transfer free as well. Yeah, you do have a lot of money. Obviously, because we took an extra 30k chest. Pretty low on L stones, I would like to get more, honestly.
Oh my god. Took a few extra steps. Okay, good. Not punished. Leonis, thank you for the good luck. We're off and set the bottom, so we start at the bottom. Remember to put Tressa on Hunt uh, Dancer as well. Stick to the plan. Hopefully, we get to skip Orwell. skipping this because we took an extra encounter just now so we don't save all that time back but we at least save some of that time back and we do have extra money as well I do absolutely want to go from Victor's Hollow I want to take the Archmage encounter still Not even worth killing this right now. Okay, this. Run. Please run. Okay. Very unlucky. This is like 20% or something according to zero. So I shouldn't be getting it this often. And I don't think it's worth killing that because the chubby Kate ran away. Leaving me with a lot less XP and JP, so this is a pretty trash dry sunk split. Now, the good thing is we didn't get the thief shrine encounter though, so at least better than the last run. But definitely kill this one. Okay, that's a good surprise. Uh. Oh, higher elbow. <laughs> that is extremely, extremely good. I made up the. I got back the fire L, which I had to burn just now because I got the encounter. That is incredible. Okay. 
パーク後はいいか行きましょうこれを私の番これをえよっしゃでっ守りがバラードさてと千本やり Okay, the filter should be on Alpha, so just pay attention. Of course, you give the Thunder M. I still have two essences of pomegranate. Boy. Could have been a better split if I didn't get ambushed. I think I lost like 20 seconds to that, maybe. Forty-four seventy-seven. So I think I take the encounter in Tressa two, and then I should be good. I do not need to take any other encounters, and I probably could teach Luminescence, although I'm going to play it safe and not teach it. Unless I get like a really good encounter in Tressa two, then yeah, for sure I teach it later. Forty-four seventy-seven is pretty decent, I think. We could have actually had more JP if we, uh, if we, uh, uh Orwell battle instead of the OP four one. Yeah, I am not gonna kill this. This it's pretty slow to kill. Well, I guess not that slow to kill. Actually, it's a decent encounter. If I get a doggo still, if I get a doggo still, it'll be better here. I, I would have had to use Glacius for the one outside. Ignis will break the little dudes, which is slow. So I had to use Glacius. Okay, this one's good. Lux will kill these ones. Okay, this one's better than the one outside. And we're gonna get a heal off of Omar as well. And I do want to try to uh, get the entire Ignis on the break of Omar. So I want to uh, spearhead 
if I don't get anyone before OP. I do get some. What? I do get someone before OP. Once I confused, so I open. Uh, a bit of time loss. It's the I think it's because of the extra encounter outside. Fifty five. Do you get any blooms? I think we got like one bloom, right? I, I I think we might have gotten like one bloom. Anyway, we do have one extra, so we did purchase an extra one. I'm gonna skip this one in Vector's Hollow. I'm gonna steal the one later in Noble Core. Because that one comes with money. Discount? Oh. Okay, wrong one. Spared it nothing. Wait, just don't know why I didn't turn there. The okay, elephant's at the bottom. Don't forget, it's at the bottom. Teach. I think I have a free heal. Will we be level 20? Uh, will we get a heal off of Tiger is the question. Uh, maybe. May get it, may not get it. Now we do have one wind out which we can burn here. Um, but I do want to save it if I can. So hopefully just get like bats and, bats and scorpions and OP first or something. It's basically only the elementals which you have to throw the wind at. Uh, if I get the elementals, I will still throw the wind owl though. Uh, but it makes it so that if... Mm, yeah, if I need to use an elstone against Arma, I might have to throw like one of the stones I need for Haunted too. So, uh, assuming I do not get any extra stones, like props and stuff. Funny thing is the elemental can actually drop stones. Oh, fantastic. Okay. It's fantastic. The drops blooms will be extra nice. Alright, gave me essences of pomegranate and extra curious blooms. That's by far the earliest I've ever seen that encounter. But I think we should still be safe. We shouldn't get a second encounter, I think. Dude, that's kind of unlucky. Okay, we do not. That's the earliest I've seen that encounter. I got put. 
Okay, we will attack your oppressor. This can guarantee our collect. Don't want to lose a run to uh thirty percent. I mean one per one percent. Oh, we do have extra money, so that's a good thing at least. But it's free money, so why not? Okay, if I... If I... If I level, that would be nice. I do level, that's awesome. Okay. And do save a nice chunk of time as well. Chester didn't level though, but it's not important for Chester to level, so it's fine. Okay. Next menu I want to do from the... Uh, the the shop. I want to do from the shop. And remember Alphans at the bottom. Do I have to, t yeah, I have to take off the ring from Alphan, so yeah. That's why I need to start with Alpin first. Nice discount. It's a very big discount. I just want to sell everything. I always can't. I always can't find hang tough. Uh, okay. So later, later on, the snatch over covers. No, no, it's hang tough over snatch. Okay, good. So I didn't have to burn the wind out just now, which is ideal. So now I do have an extra stone for Gizarma later. Because I I'll, I'll have two wind elves by the time I get to Yvonne. So one will be on Yvonne, the other one will be thrown on Gizarma if I need to. So I don't have to dig into my lights or my fire. And obviously not a shadow. It's the most valuable stone. Limited edition shadow. Shadow L. You do not want to burn that if you can. Okay, do not attack Ophi. Okay, very good. We even get his last stand here for swag. You're on a pick, thanks for the good luck. 
All right, great. 127.51, considerably better than the last run. Which was, I believe, uh, 128.48 or something. Okay. So actual pace now will be two minutes slower, so 129.51. So definitely could have been better still, but I think this run is still doing relatively well. Let me go and get some tea.
Tea is for the weak. Hydrate with tap water. <laughs> I mean, it's essentially tap water with some added flavors in it. So, we Asians, we don't really drink tap water. So what we do is we actually take the tap water and then we boil it <laughs> before drinking. But when I'm overseas, like, well, when I was in Europe, I just drank tap water. So I, I don't have any problems with that, but uh, at home, we drink boiled water. <laughs> we drink boiled tap water. It has to be boiled. We do not drink water from the tap. <laughs> At home. <laughs> Drink water from the rain directly. Hmm. I'm pretty sure some places actually do that. They like take the rain water and then they uh, they they uh, process it, and make it a bit, uh, make it potable. Hey, thanks, Jack. A uh, new Goldera record by like two hours. I can't believe Octopap is up on 40. <laughs> Beat the entire game and the final super boss in under one hour and 30 minutes. Who knew that Esmeralda was Goldera all along? So yeah, just to see the pace, we are 4 minutes ahead, but the actual pace will be only 2 minutes ahead because... Um, as you can see, there's a missing split over there, like just 2 splits later, uh, we have to go and pick up Russell. I mean, pick up Cyrus, so that takes 2 minutes. I just realized, actually, that... Just realized, actually, that, um... That, um, we... We might have to throw two... Might have to throw, like, two stones, because we have to... F we might potentially have to throw a stone in Russell, potentially have to throw a stone in Gisarma. That's not ideal, actually. I could actually inquire the stone here. It is pretty slow, though, to go and get it. But it might be a viable option if you're running low on stones. Because you can scrutinize him, like, right as you enter. Or you could do it, like, in Alphan 2, but you have to run to scrutinize him. Or inquire. Uh... I think it's kind of like Isarma, so if you have OP first, like, you need an L stone to kill as well. Because at that point, you still don't have Elemental 8, nor do you have, like, stronger strikes or whatever, so your, your damage is pretty weak. <laughs> he's 6,000 HP. Actually, it's not that much. Actually, I think it's like 5,009 or something. It's actually not that much. Oh, what is this turn order? Uh, wow, what is this turn order? All right, just don't poison Therion, please. Okay, yeah, that's fine. It's still kind of slow, though. 
You're a slow girl, OP. You're a slow girl. Okay, not level... Not level uh, 30, so no Thunder L from Noble Core for me. Okay, we're level 29, so again, we want to make sure we uh, hack Orlik in the face, just split it in two with the Death Cleaver. My level from Gideon. Might, might level from Gideon. I think at this rate we do level from Gideon, right? For sure. Oh yeah, we do get a free heal off of Russell. We do have to get a free heal uh, off of picking Cyrus up. So I don't have to... Uh, I don't have to uh, heal here, do I? Oh wait, I do. Because I need to... But I don't have to give the Refreshing Jam. I can just give an Inspiriting Plum because after this uh, we get a free heal. So I just need OP to have enough SP to to last the battle. Oh, shouldn't have done it. Uh, chest is where I have to defend with someone. Yeah, Alvin's here to save the day in case we miss any ranges, but I don't think we will. Dude, one axe hit might be enough, even. I think if you get like absolutely low roll for every single thing, then yeah, you need two axe hits, but that's not very likely. You could probably make do with just one axe. It's so, so, so awkward that now you have to come down here just to steal a magic L and then you don't have to do a pattern swap. Or magic M. Uh, 
So not only do you get a free heal from this, Cyrus also gets free heal from this after he levels, which is extra optimal for Gideon. And then I think we should be leveling from Gideon as well. So this XP route is actually working out pretty well so far. So I think, yeah, one person before OP would be ideal. Nope, of course not. It's 3009. Uh, throw the win. It's 3009, so. Yeah, you need you need any L stone, basically. You need any L stone, basically. Three thousand nine, which means that the times, for no times three. So two thousand six. I think you need a times four to kill. Actually, I think you need a times four to kill. So you want one person. You want like you want like one person before Ophi. Then you can feed a pump M to her. Can consider actually no, we don't have the Gideon's dagger yet. What am I talking about? So the nice thing here is you do not have to heal Cyrus at all, because, um, because he got a free heal from his level up. Hmm. So that's really nice for this route, because in the past you had to, you had to like, you had to like make sure Cyrus didn't die and stuff, and you also got a free heal from Russell. So, OP's SP is great, right now. Don't have to heal her SP, and then she. On top of that, she's gonna level off of Gideon. Which is extra nice, because then you don't have to do any healing uh, for Yvonne. Uh, maybe, maybe heal Tressa. But yeah, I don't think you have to do any healing. It's kind of unlucky. You get Study Pro as well. Important part is OP's before Gideon, otherwise he does that really slow attack. The OP actually didn't take any damage. I mean, no, Tressa actually didn't take any damage. Oh, wow, we're losing time here. No, it's because of the encounter and also because of solar fight, I guess. Wait, no, everybody leveled. Okay, that's great. That was pretty slow, actually. Did lose a lot of time here. We're still two minutes ahead. We need to hold on to as much of this lead as we can. Uh, okay, snatch over cover. Uh, uh, snatch. Okay, there we go.
everyone leveling is pretty nice here, actually. Yeah, I was concerned that I might have had to heal Tressa. I think my my the, the last run got a uh, pretty I got a pretty good Yvonne apart from well it, it got a pretty good Yvonne I just didn't collect it but all in all still pretty much ideal fight in terms of speedness spilled some tea on my desk something what are chances of getting the encounter here like 30 percent should hopefully not Lucky. Please just run. Okay. It's not too bad. It's pretty scary. I hate the encounter here. So we're losing time again then. Uh, okay. The good thing is that OP is before all the ads. But the bad thing is that Tressa got hit and she's actually not. She's actually pretty squishy now. Oh. It's really bad. It had to be Tressa. I'm not gonna collect him. Uh, okay, I'm okay with not collecting Yvonne. I'm okay with not collecting Yvonne, because I took the 30k in OP4 just now. Because I got the encounter. So I took the 30k there, so I'm okay with not collecting Yvonne. It's far from an ideal fight, but it is what it is. So there's one good thing about... It's one good thing about getting that 30k is that you don't have to collect Yvonne. If it comes down to that, you don't have to collect him. We should still have enough money for a BTX. I mean, uh, the BT style. Gentle Sir. It's a pretty nice uh, title. I wish you can. I wish you can, like, not have Cyrus here. I really hate this encounter with Study Foe. Alright, we finally get to put the party back in the, in the correct order.
So I'm very happy that now in hindsight, I'm very happy that I got a 30k. Because otherwise, if I wanted to collect Yvonne, I would have had to. I would have had to like. Uh, I, it, it would have like cost me a lot of time. To collect Yvonne, because then he unbreaks, and then your Elstone doesn't deal as much damage. And it's, yeah, it's a mess. Well, actually, no, I could have thrown the Elstone with Cyrus. Collected Yvonne, and then throw an Emstone on the next turn, but you know, that's still like kind of slow. I was like, okay, I'm just, I just won't collect Yvonne then. Yeah. We did still save 40 seconds, so it's not like we lost like a shit ton of time. That's about how much I usually save on that split. Hey, Death Zero, long time no see. Uh, okay. <laughs> Two shadows. That's correct. Yeah, I do have two shadows. No, this is PC. Uh, if you if you couldn't tell, I, I I'm using keyboard. Just in case you couldn't tell. Didn't have to burn a wind stone. Okay. Oh, it's like, oh shoot. Forgot to steal a wind stone. Okay, didn't have to burn the extra we, we didn't have to burn the extra stone on uh on Gisarma, so that's great. So I will skip the whisper mill stones and just steal the two winds. If I had to burn like a light, I would have been forced to steal three stones from the Whisper Mill dude. Okay, so now I have to remember that Han is actually in the first slot. So it's gonna throw off some of my party slots later. Tressa also is. Okay, no, she's covered by Elfin, is she not? Yeah, she's covered by Elfin, so I do not have to worry about Tressa dying here. I don't have to heal Tressa, but she actually might. She actually might uh, live. And uh, she might level from the dudes. I think we are gonna level from the dudes. Also have Luminescence, so. Just keep that in mind. I do have Luminescence. Did have enough JP to teach Luminescence this time? GSD, good to see you. Thanks for the good luck. Isn't that Therion Freak encounter just like one of the most cringe encounters ever? Like every time you get it, you just like cringe. Like uncontrollably cringe. I know I do. Every time I see it, I'm like, Ugh, disgusting. Yeah, uh, we are... Those are pretty big skips. And the funny thing about the Adamantine skip is that you can still get the encounter. The, the whole point is you don't... You want to skip the Adamantine hat and the money. And then you skip the encounter. <laughs> In this run, I, I still got the encounter. So what I did was I turned back and I got 30k and then I... And I went on. With the run. 
But it actually paid off in the end uh, to get that 30k. Oh, very nice discount. That makes up for the fact that I didn't get to collect Yvonne, actually. Well, it's still 10... I mean, it's 10k less, but it's still a really, really good discount. Bravely Default. Um, if you're talking about the original games, no. Um, Bravely Default 2, I might play on PC. I do have the Switch version, but I, I, I haven't... I, I didn't... I didn't finish it. Maybe I'll if I maybe I can get the PC version and I'll try, uh, play again on PC because uh, the Switch something that really annoyed me about the Switch version is that the loads are incredibly slow. So I'll get the maybe I'll get the PC version. Be nicer. I do like the game. I do like the game. BD two. Okay, I do have luminescence. Don't have to heal Tressa. Level. She does not level. That's fine though, she's under- she's in cover range. And I believe Elfin is cover now, so everybody- every one of Gareth's goons attacks are physical, so it's fine. Uh, uh... Oh, yeah, that, that, that's fair. Alright, OP not first, please. Oh! Okay, that's kind of bad. Okay, absolutely peacock her. Absolutely peacock her. That was annoying. I... I don't know why though. Like, it's so rare that the cursor still stays on that ad. I've never seen it before. This is the first time I've seen the cursor stay on that ad. Like, it should have reset, like... From Yvonne. What's ATPR SD for? Okay. I do have to heal. Nourish out, Tressa. Uh. Okay, everyone set full. No, I don't. My eyes are fine. Thank you for asking. Okay, very good. Uh, perfect. Fire. 
Pressure is on OP. That last next turn. Wait, rip Emperor. For sure, very nice. Okay. Uh, revitalizing gem. Oh, I got the dupe even. Fight's pretty much over now. Alright, see you later, Sierra. It's been good knowing you. Alright, nice. Need some time it's by default, so I have uh, more to do. Um, and so we go hard worker, hunter, like how Tressa gets dancer, and then we put hard worker over. Uh, hard worker goes over. Grows on trees, grows on trees. Two, three. Uh, How many blooms do we have? Oh, we, we do we do have like extra blooms, so it's fine. Oh, fantastic! I do not have to like hold at all. Okay, just keep in mind the cursor is on there on here. Fantastic fight, fantastic. Uh, okay, we'll be, uh, 569 is the amount of JP we have. Five, six, nine. So I do need one encounter. I think I should be able to take like any encounter. Yeah, I, I should be able to take any encounter, even if I get one in Alpin Four. I think the minimum JP you get is like two, two, two from Alpin Four. So that is enough because we need four, seven, seven, nine later. So two, two, two will make it so that we do have at least four, seven, seven, nine. Now, ideally, I do skip the encounter here, though. I kind of still want to get the money in Warbringer, just because it's going to be useful, but I did get the BT discount, so... I did get a BT stop discount, so... I actually could take an Elven 4 encounter and then go for a Warbringer skip. 
And that is also an option. And I wouldn't be much... I wouldn't be, like, really down money because, um... Uh, I did get the BT staff discount. So we should still be more or less equal in money. We do have to get the sword group though. If we can get a sword group discount, that'd be nice. But I think we definitely purchased a sword group. Definitely. So ideally, ideally I skip here and take more bringer, so then I can get the money. Ideally, you get it though. I will take this. This is a good encounter. Just have to heal afterwards. Definitely would have preferred to take Warbringer, but now I can go for a Warbringer skip. And yeah, I can do the menu right after Ogre Eagle, and I can go for a Warbringer skip. So we'll lose time here, unfortunately. Hopefully we'll be able to save time next split, though, if we can very fortunately skip the... Very luckily skip the... Or bring your shrine battle. Okay, whatever you do, just don't stay this. Okay. Perfect. I can save Palm L as well. Uh, using purifying. Alright, perfect. How much time are you losing? About 20 seconds. Just because of the encounter. Oh, it's a lot of time loss actually. <sighs> It'll be really bad if we fail to run from a Warbringer encounter, so hopefully you just don't get it. It's actually not that likely to skip it, that's the thing. goes on snatch wait uh yeah cover okay so it's evasive maneuvers and cover i i just keep forgetting it's covered there so that was not a that was not a very good menu Okie dokie. Uh, please let me skip the battle. Please, please, please. Pretty please. 
see, it's so many steps to take the 30k. Please reward me. Uh, no. I mean, I could have killed it, but... Really unlucky. ゲームメッシュや。頑張ります。エレメントブレイクロット。Oh man, this could have been a split we tried we could save time on, but instead we just lost. We gained nothing out of it. Unfortunate. Uh, my next split in my PB is very good as well. Hill and Hardy, Hill goes on, extra experience. Very nice, got the Sword Grove discount. and Therion took damage. I think Therion should be fine. Yeah, everyone level, but it's good. Yeah, from now on it's mostly just bleeding time. We're mostly just gonna bleed time from now on. Uh, the goal is not to bleed over 1 minute and 40 seconds, obviously. So if Alphen before Balagar, I can do... I can do something nice. If I get Alpha V for Balagar, I can do something nice. Oh, nice. Uh. Good turn. <laughs> それでは、オペリーケネブラン。よし。頑張ります。エレメントブレイクロット。And save a pump and then you save like bandit so it's uh, just a nice little optimization if you get elfin 
before uh, Balagar. Bracelet, sword throw. I think that nice little optimization actually made us not lose too much time on that split, maybe? It could have helped a bit. Because I'm pretty sure my PB gets, uh, uh it's like, four seconds. Uh, so my PB gets, like, OP first in game counter, so it, it did save some of it. Maybe what I could have done was I could have uh, I could have killed the Warbringer encounter and tried to skip like a Primbri encounter later. But then if I get like two hundred encounters and Sky, I kind of just wasted my time. Oh wait, no, I actually I actually saved uh, 3 seconds on Balagar. Okay, okay. So yeah, that was a nice optimization to actually save time. So the band high health is actually pretty slow and of course you have to use the um, M as well. We do still have the wind M. I mean the wind L. Two, three. Uh, okay. So nice, I got text skip. Hey Sam, thanks for your luck. And my PB gets my PB gets a five for a team. What's my best? It's like five oh five. I think it's five oh five. I think my best from before was 505. So 514 is pretty good time. Oh wait, I got I got OP first in Archibald. That was pretty dumb. In my in my PB. Or in my previous run. Not my PB. My PB got a pretty standard, I think. Pretty standard uh chapter two. It's like no no amazing fights with nothing with that was really bad. BT staff and optimize. <laughs> yeah! 
負けられぬ Okay, Joshua. It's not like super amazing, but it's not terrible. This definitely kills. Yeah, we had BT. Uh, we had Sword World. We will level from Gustav, it seems. That's very nice. Come on! Good, good Archibald. Good Archibald, come on. Oh, ho! Oh, that's really good. It's really, really good. That's really, really good. And to top it all off, we're leveling for off uh, Gustav. Alright, fantastic. Okay, not perfect, but it's not bad. Attack is good. The faster one of the two. Use that last. Attack. A level slash. That's a slower attack. But yeah, very good Oberg chapter 2. It's a very nice chapter. If you used, uh, if you used attack instead of level slash, it would have been really nice. Save the few more seconds. We need to heal SP, so knowledge staff, unequip, unequip dagger. Will be first. Very nice. Fantastic. Alright. I'll be first again. Lovely. Was last run it. 41 seconds. So last run was still ahead of BB at this point. Start losing a lot of time later on in the run, I think. So we can't rest on our law rules now. We have to keep up the we have to keep up the good work. Okay, good. My PB gets an encounter here.
け我が剣は守るべきもののためにいつかさせるか負けませんエレメントブレイクロット私の番クジャクナマイいい覚悟はいいかこれを使えるクリスキャプティエレメントをブレイク。So, a bit of a slower fight still. I have to burn the wind all right uh i'll steal this for good i don't think i need it i'll steal it for good measure i should still be fine i i, I think i have two wind l still that means i'm fine right so i shouldn't need it i think i have two wind l so i i don't think i need it ice l um But you know, just in case something, just in case something happens, might be nice to have it. I don't know. We should have palm elves here. We have palm elves. Nice. In order. My Albert, my boy Albert, before the red hat man. Okay. Uh, so we put put boost start. Boost start goes over、uh, a hang tough for a Tressa. Decent Werner, no terror, random people. If you care someone, I have to defend with old brick, I think. Unless I can't heal off the status.
が剣を守るべき者のために。Okay, so it's fine if he tears someone. This is fine. So, yeah, I was fine if he tarot someone because I could have used OP this turn to break instead. She was naturally going before Werner, so I could have avoided using Dagger of All Break, which he would stay this. And then OP next turn can use Tonitrus to kill Werner. Okay. Darion, I really need you to do your job. It's 55%. Please just get it. Please, please, please. Pretty please. Attaboy. Alright, Hanit goes in the second slot. And Hanit should be in the first. Hanit should be... Okay. Oh, this make, makes the menu smoother, actually. Alright, Tressa, get the BT Blade discount and you are a literal god. Okay, no. You're you're not a god. It's fine. You're fine as you are. So, Therion goes over Elfin, and then we start with Therion on the equipment. BT Blade, and then up to the accessories. Uh, Atlas Badge, Necklace, Optimize, oops. Okay, here we go. I definitely have enough stones. I can even just toss three out three random health stones on this guy. I don't even need the M stones. I, I do have a Thunder M, right? Okay, I'll I'll toss a Thunder M. Oh, I have three Thunder M's, it's a lot. Okay. Great. All right, Tressa. Double Tomahawk. Nope. So it looks like we're getting Viper late again, most likely. Yeah, it would have helped if we got for example, the uh, it would have helped if we had gotten the the Warbringer chest. That would have been that would have been good to get. Unfortunately, not. Uh, fine though. Uh, Shadow Light should be too. Sacred Shadow, thanks for the good luck. Good fight, fight. Yeah, I didn't need the Ice L. That was my bad. I didn't need to steal it. My mistake. Lost like a couple of seconds doing that. Okay, 
Okay, good. Okay, those are all crits. Oh god, not again. Uh, I'm not even down on magic. I'm not even down elemental attack. I, I just naturally missed the range. I have the sword group on, by the way. I don't think it's because I'm down level. It's definitely not. I'm, I'm definitely normal level. It's not possible to be, to be that behind on XP. <laughs> so instead of instead of using uh, BT Blade, you can actually toss any random L stone, I guess. You really do not want to miss the range. It does more damage. It's really unlucky. Holy. Yeah, I do have the sword throw. I shouldn't be missing that. I shouldn't be missing that ring. I mean, it is still a range, but... I, I have to be really unlucky to miss that range. With the sword rope on. I've never missed it with the sword rope. The only time I missed it was the previous run, but I had elemental heavy armor there. Alright, do not. Okay, very good. Perfect, Alayak. Perfect, Alayuk. Very, very nice. Alright, what are the chances of skipping this encounter? I think it's like less than 50%. Or just about 50%. Which obviously means never. And we do skip it. Awesome. Okay, the one inside's like 20% or something. But it's like 80% if you skip the one outside. Yes! Got it! Really nice haunted chapter 3. And if I get... OP before the dragon. That's a nice time save, because there aren't a lot of There aren't a lot of places where you can save time on my PV in this endgame. So any any time save here is appreciated. 15 seconds is a is a lot of time save. Considering how optimized my, my endgame was. Uh oops to Marcelum. Alright, I'm not gonna steal the palm elves. I have like a ton of pomegranates. Ton 
ton of pomegranates, so let's remember to guide Maruf. I don't think I've ever forgotten the guy Maru. Amazingly, my PV was like kind of even with my. My last one's kind of even with my PV. I right, could get the chest here, but I don't think it's worth it ever because you never ever skip the encounter to get that chest. What's up, QB? What's your question? Oh my god, that's so good. That is so good. That is so, so, so good. He did level off a dragon as well, so... Let's make sure. It's baby oil made from. Please don't kill Han. Uh, no, this is fine. I need 144. And I have 158. Okay, 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 okay. I like this, I like this, I like this. I do like this a lot. Alright, very nice. We lose some time because the encounter was uh, not optimal. Hanging on, hanging on. This baby all made from? Sorry, QB, I, I don't know. Probably, <coughs> probably just vegetable oil as well, isn't it? <laughs> Thanks, Q. Equip Prim, equip Prim, do not forget to equip Prim. So close. Go, go, go. Yeah, kind of an optimal. Did my PB get the encounter as well? Oh, level up of Rufus. This is actually pretty good. Leveling off a of roof is pretty nice, you get free heal, and then you don't have to heal your SP through poor Albus. We have to kill the encounter though.
babies. It's a pretty interesting kind of bee. What's up, my boy Shem? How you doing? Thanks for the raid. Thanks for the good luck. Three fifty one poggers. Incredible. The gaming. GG Shem. I would even say that sub three fifty is not far for not too big of a stretch for you. Good enough. No, no Viper Dagger. You're gonna get Sabaru in Odyssey? Okay. Respectable choice. It's good to switch it up. Don't be like me. I'm a very stubborn... A very stubborn runner. I don't switch games at all. Cosmos for under plate. Of course. Oh, I thank you, Shem. <laughs> Yo, lots of raids today. Thank you, Ank, for the raid. How did your rogues run go? It, it, it's it's mostly fake goats because uh, I've only done one run with the current route, so most of my so most of my splits are gonna be gold. Yeah, it's it's always good to try to wean off the notes. Next time, next time you'll get it. Hey, okay, very good. We do have enough for Albus as well. I don't think we'll level from Albus, unfortunately. So we're gonna have to manually heal later. Yeah, just barely didn't level. So I just need 144 SP, so I don't need to heal all the way up because I'm gonna level from Simeon 1. Have to have the sword core ready, don't have to steal it. I do really need money though, because I, I still need to purchase the Viper Dagger later. 
I think we have to take the money later. Okay, that is enough. Actually, use one more plum than I needed to. Oh, what recce? What recce uh, did you just see? Thank you, Leonis. I'll do my best. FF thirteen two, nice. Good. Good, 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 good. Very good, very good. We should have enough for. So I think what we have to do is I have to get the. I might have to do some selling. I might have to do some selling. In Dust Barrow, actually. Kaya! Nice. Legendary Kaya. Sasseruka. <laughs> Check cursor. Okay, good. So Ophi did level. Tressa didn't level. I think Tressa should be fine. Oh, really good. Just that's cover as well. I could have went times three, but. There we are, I think. And times three we print this turn. Overall, still a good split. Last 10 seconds still. Wonder what that's. Okay. I still need. Still need money for my Viper. Uh, uh, I need like 60k, I need like 61k, so I'm gonna have to pick up the, I'm gonna have to sell and then I'm gonna have to pick up the money, I think. Congratulations on not dying, Cyrus. Cyrus, because we need him to get JP. 
learn skills later. Okay, I do want to pick up money. Also, we need to do his story. Friendship. Uh, let's try elemental edge, and yeah, that's all. <laughs> okay, menu. I I'm still not really good at this menu since I changed it. Do need money as well. Okay, we had 30k, so we should have 45 We sh We will have enough for a Viper Dagger, but I'm still gonna need a bit more money for, uh, still gonna need a bit more money for, for my Adamantine hat. No, they're not. For Honda, we use stones, for Albright, we use hired help. Prop! Okay, no, unlucky. BT stops sometimes will make Lucia slower. Yeah, definitely, because if you break, it's like a 7 turn fight. That's why Lucia is the second to last boss that you do. You wait until you get all the... You wait until you're like... Extremely overpowered that you don't even need to break her. Alright, so after this is Viper. Piper. Okay, so the target target money is uh, hundred thousand, I think. I'm gonna try to get a hundred thousand leaves. Spear, starting with my dude. I hate this. I hate this place. I have to lose time here. There's, there's, I can't do anything about this. I, I, I need to purchase the Viper Dagger. Here's because I have no money. Just now. I didn't have money just now. So I am probably going to lose like 20 seconds or something. That's just the way it is. Uh, the reason why I needed more money is uh, because there is in fact one more item which I need to purchase in Northreach called the Adamantine Hat.
Mm. Very good. We might even be able to uh, purchase the sprightly necklace. Okay, yeah. Okay, good. First try. Yes. We do the fights in a very specific... We do the chapters in a very specific order. So that as we complete certain uh, character stories, then that unlocks NPCs and the next character stories, which we can purchase items from. So for example, like... Uh, finishing Ulbrich 4 gives you... Uh, access to the double Tomahawk in Stoneguard which we can purchase. Obviously, we're not going to do the Ogin quest to get the double tomahawk because that's slow. So the fastest way to get it is to purchase it in Stoneguard. And you, you have to go to Stoneguard for Haunted Chapter 2. So that's why you do Ulbrich Chapter 4 before you do Haunted Chapter 2. Okay, good. Okay, so no choice. I do have to lose time. I, I, I must lose time here. There's just no way. Yeah, we just we just didn't have the money. We 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 had to lose that 20 28 seconds. We just didn't have the money. Okay, don't forget, I still need to equip the Viper Dagger, so... Viper Dagger, Adamantine Shield, and then Mighty Belt over the Necklace, and then... Tressa gets the Optimize, and the two Augmenters, and we don't have to put the Badger Friendship anymore on Cyrus, because it's already on him. Okay, that menu was very well done. Okay, 
るものかさせるかエレメントブレイクラフト行きましょうこれが yeah, ton of pomegranates I don't really need to bother with the Don't AVP And can you just like pomegranates for every single fight? Please, please. Tomahawk and Ulbrich、uh, yeah, stuff. Ulbrich's here.、Uh, yes, uh, uh. Oh, perfect. Okay. Boss is possible fight ever. This is perfect because you just do this and you do this. I've never gotten this pattern. This is the best pattern to get here. Because now Tress is the first next turn and she kills the dragon. Okay, so now we got Darius. Darius is the most dangerous fight here. And、uh, I will do this. Alright, if I can one turn Maddie, that would be nice. I didn't really expect it though. Oh, I can one turn Maddie. Okay. <laughs> cool. Yeah, it's the Rune Lord Ultimate. Okay. Pretty good, Matt. Pretty good, Matthias. Another menu. Yeah, I'm 
Oh, yeah, this is a perfect fight as well. Perfect. One hit of each element. Perfect fight. It's where you use the, the turn one break here is useful because Therion's not going for open next turn. To break on turn one immediately, kill immediately kill it on turn two. Alright, let's remember to heal Therion. Healing great. I would say this is a pretty good gauntlet. You know, some the Darius fight maybe could have gone better, Simeon could have gone better, but all in all, still a very good gauntlet. So yeah, pretty happy with that. I should, I think I should be saving a bit of time on my PB here in the gauntlet. Okay, I saved like seven seconds. Uh, Prim. Order is different from what I'm used to. <laughs> Cyrus is healing, so OP has to heal here. He has to heal first. Phase one is okay. Can dry songs here.
これでどうすかそこからよアルターウェイトアルターウェイトぜいほっまっては負けんしばろがよ<笑>少しは成長できたでしょうか。Come on, man. It's just one thing. Just stay around, please. Go before the mob. Or even in the first one. Oh, he's in the second slot. Oh, come on, again! Why do I always get Therion first? It's like the third run in a row I got Therion first. Okay, Liquid Light Black. Yeah, not ideal, honestly. Record! Got record! Foggers! Foggers! Well, it's honestly, like... This- I, I'm- I'm- I'm kinda upset that I didn't get a 23 cause- cause Therion. But I'm happy with this run, I think. I don't think I wanna torture myself. I'm- I'm- I will, uh, I will, uh, I will take this run. I, I'll be happy with, I'm, I'm happy with this run. 